so for ini there is no value of half baked information if you read limited material for ini ct that's okay but be 100 percent sure that you remember correct things only hello everyone welcome to my channel myself dr akash and i have secured a rank of 1912 in neat pg 2025 also i have secured a rank of 722 in ini ct november 24 in this video i am going to share what things you need to do differently for INI. So, what's till the end? Let's start. INI CT is more PYQ based. Throughout the years, I have observed that at least 110 to 20 questions usually comes from PYT, either as direct repeat or with some twist. So, you need to be thorough in PYQ. Solve custom module based on PYQ daily. Match the following type questions and sequence based questions are frequently asked in INICT. So try to remember sequences like EC coupling, cross bridge mechanism, auditory pathway, development of respiratory system, development of eye, neural tube, the development of pancreas, closure of structures in fetal circulation, cardinal movements of liver. Solve matching questions by ruling out options if you don't know all answers. For multiple option correct type questions, you can solve only by ruling out options. And for that, you need to be sure that whatever you know is correct. So for INI, there is no value of half-baked information. If you read limited material for INI CT, that's okay, but be 100% sure that you remember correct things only. Next is time management. In NEET, you need to solve 40 questions in 42 minutes. But in INICT, you will get only 45 minutes to solve 50 questions. So time management is very important. Try to solve custom modules of 50 questions within 30 minutes at home so that you can get 15 minutes to revise at least. At first do sure short questions. Leave calculation based questions, don't click, marked for review. After doing easy questions, start from first questions again and now do problem solving questions, critical thinking questions. Now I am going to give you a broad idea about the topics you need to do specifically for INICT. I will be doing subject specific more detailed video which topics you need to read. So watch till the end. For physiology, do Guyton special class for images from Guyton, graphs class from compile module of BTR. Read nerve muscle physiology, understand chronaxi rheobase, do problems on tetanizing frequency. Don't skip CNS physiology. In CVS, read BP regulation and cardiac reflexes, application of cardiac cycle and pressure volume loop. From respiratory physiology, understand ventilation perfusion curve and clinical applications like pneumonia and pulmonary embolism. Understand regulation of respiration, permutation combination of transaction of pons medulla and vagus cut are getting asked frequently. In anatomy, read embryology thoroughly. Read histology, general anatomy in detail. Watch cadaveric image discussion by Ashwanisar, which is available on YouTube. Read skull foramina, cranial nerves, parts of papet circuit, muscle of mastication, tongue muscle, understand development of arterial and venous system, understand the development of heart also, from abdomen read relations of kidney, perineal pouches, from lower limb read Trendelenburg gate, remember normal side drops, gluteus media supplied by superior gluteal nerve and gluteus maximus supplied by inferior gluteal nerve. In biochemistry, Read biochemical tests, read test for amino acids, read urea cycle, amino acid disorders and nitrogen scavengers. Read cycles, key regulatory steps of cycles, activators and inhibitors of cycle. Read molecular biology in detail. Read pedoxysomal disorders and vitamin is always important for both INI and NEET. In pathology, do Robin special class, histopathology image class from compiled module of BTR. Read proto-oncogen, tumor suppressor gene, revise them frequently. Otherwise, you will forget them. 
read lymphoma leukemia in detail. Do thalassemia, PNH. Read PNH specifically in depth. CD markers, cause of death have been asked already. From practical aspect, read WBC, RBC pipette, vacutainers, sequence of blood collection already asked. Read transfusion medicine, very important. Read composition of CPD, CP sagam. Read blood components, read difference between trali and taco. Remember, trali within 6 hours, in taco, JBP will be raised. Don't go in controversy of which one is the most common. In micro, read biochemical tests, culture media, general bacteriology and general virology. See the images of culture media. Give more time to mycology and parasitology. Question has been asked from chromoblastomycosis, aspergillosis, beta-glucan and galactomannan test. Read exoparasite. I think you all know Neha and shoot pneumonic. Read immunology, CD markers of cell and checkpoint inhibitors. In pharma, read new drugs, anti-cancer drugs, monoclonal antibodies, targeted therapy, antimicrobial, anti-tubercular, anti-HIV and their side effects. Question has been asked which causes intracranial bleeding, tiptranavir, tip tip bleeding. Read sedatives, anti seizure medications. Frequently questions are getting asked from anti-diabetic drugs like which drug is safe in renal failure, which causes lactic acidosis, vitamin B12 deficiency, which can be given in heart failure, which drug can cause heart failure, which can cause pancreatitis, fracture, UTI, fornias gangrene, SIADH. So all the side effects of anti-diabetic drugs you should remember. In FSM, give time to toxicology including alcohol. Read firearm injuries, age estimation, names like Ashley rule, frogman accuracy, Gustafsson criteria, Darhan test. Various indices like corporal index, medullary index. In PSM, read biostatistics, epidemiology and vaccine in detail. Most of the questions of PSM get asked from these topics only. In ENT, read instruments, auditory pathway, vestibular function test, tuning fork test, PTA, PNS, laryngeal nerve supply and application like hoarseness of voice. Type of neck dissection and structure spared in neck dissection are also getting asked. In I, give emphasis on understanding retina, neuroophthal and squint. Cross section of retina images has been asked multiple times. In medicine, read neuro in detail. Read core medicine topics like ECG, ABG, emergency medicine including MI management, stroke management. Read cardiac biomarkers, sequence of cardiac events. Try to remember this. Read effects of preload and afterload on murmur, specifically on HOCM and mitral valve prolapse. Read JVP well. In surgery, read breast, general surgery including trauma, head neck, oral cavity, thyroid, arterial and venous disorder. Just go through once images from belly love. In last INA exam, SADIS operation asks directly from belly. In obstetrics, read prenatal test for Down syndrome, Bishop score, biophysical profile, twin pregnancy in detail. Read grips, pregnancy induced hypertension, AMTSL, partograph and CTG in depth. Solve more and more clinical MCQs. In gynae, disorder of sexual development is very important. One question almost every year asked. Then read infertility, PCOS, contraception, Mullerian anomaly, cervical cancer staging and management along with HPV and pap smear. Read CIN management algorithm given nicely in short. Read ovarian cancer, vulval cancer, endometrial hyperplasia. Bulval cancer are more asked in INICT than NIPG. In pediatrics, read neonatology and neonatal resuscitation. Read congenital CMV infection, which gets asked very frequently. Read congenital heart disease and epilepsy topic. In psychiatry, read assessment tools, diagnostic criteria with part of duration for diseases. Like it is PTSD, 
if more than one month and it is acute stress reaction if less than one month. Read drugs like antipsychotic, lithium, read TCA toxicity, extra pyramidal symptoms. Do small topics like rates of insight, MMSC, Maslow hierarchy, serotonin syndromes, Freud's psychosexual stage, Kubler-Ross theory of grief, Gene Paget's cognitive development, trans-theoretical model of changes. Do newer drugs like brexanolone, trophenitide, vortioxetine. Do smoking cessation therapy, opiate addiction management. In radio, do level identification. Identify landmarks for that. Do images from surgical radiology and trauma radiology. In ortho, read nerve injury concept, bone tumors, dislocation of hip and shoulder, named classification. I have made a video of named classification. See that once. In anesthesia, read difficult intubation sequence, Mapleson circuit, oxygen delivery device, capnography, ventilation setting in ARDS, BLS and ACLS with drug doses. Read criteria for high quality CPR. In dermatology, do important topics like alopecia areata, vitiligo, pemphigus vulgaris, mechanobulus disorders, approach to genital ulcer, STD kits, drug reactions, acne management, and dermatophyte infection. So that's it for today. Hope you like this video. Please subscribe my channel. See you in the next video.